welcome to my class today I'm going to show you how to design a RCC building through stat pro at first you have to open stat pro click on new project select space give a name select the location length will be meter force will be kilometer then click next click and pin and then finish at first you have to create a node so click this on this now you can see the code node is created close this here is a plan of a four room six into five five into five so at first use seeing node cursor copy the node on clicking the right of your mouse and click on paste node <coughs> as you can see you can paste the node in the x y and z direction x direction in the here y direction is up and z direction is here according to my plan 6 meter on the x direction 5 meter in the z direction so on x sim put the value 6 select ok you can see 6 meter along the node is created you can check the distance by this here is 6 meter again select this node in the node by node cursor copy the node paste node in x direction is 5 meter ok select all the three node copy the node paste the nodes in z direction will be 5 meter ok again select the nodes copy the node paste the node in z direction is 5 meter ok this will be a 6 to 8 building so foundation will be 1 meter so click on front select other nodes copy the nodes paste the nodes in y direction is 1 meter as you can see all the nodes are created for 6 story we have to create 6 steps so we are going to select the nodes and go to repeat and you can repeat in x y and z direction we are going to create in y direction norm of steps will be 6 for 6 story space will be 3.3 meter or simple 3 meter select ok now you can see all the nodes are created now we are link the nodes so select the whole nodes go to geometry connect beam along y axis and for beam connect beams select the nodes except the foundation go to geometry and the beam along x axis and z axis as you can see the structure is complete now now we are going to go to command go to support specification support will be fixed fixed click on add go to front click on the support select the nodes and click on assign to selected nodes and assign ok now you can see asymmetric view the support is created again go to command go to member property member will be prismatic we are going to create rectangle for beams we are going to say uh, give the beam 0.35 and 0.35 
repeat add again for columns 0 0.500 0 0.500 add for row beam 0 0.300 0 0.300 add close for column we are going to select beams parallel to y for selecting y axis total y axis nodes select the This will be go in the y direction columns. So select this and go and select the columns as I am to select it. Beams. Okay. Now select the three will be two. This will be better. Select two. And x axis and select parallel to z axis. The root will be excluded, so control and select. Selected and member load will be minus 16.5 kilodon. Add for the beams and for root beam will be 3.1. Add close self weight. Click on assign to view. For beams, click on beam cursor, select the beams by using control. You can check this total beam are selected. Click on assign to select the beams, assign. Okay. beams assign ok now live load add roll load will be minus 2 kilo newton give it a range range will be this is 1 meter for PL 1 meter and this is three meter so it is will be minimum will be one meter here this and maximum will be 19 meter and close you can see in 
in dead load we, we will give the flow load is minus 5.6 range is same 1 meter to 19 meter and close as you can see for all four the load is given now go to command analyze perform analyze no print ok go to analyze this will take some time as you can see there is 0 error 0 warning done now go to design concrete design select the code for me is 456 select the parameters where we clear distance composite strength and heel strength click ok click on define parameter clear will be 0 0.025 click on add it will be 20,000 and if I is 415,000 add select clear click on assign to view assign again assign to view assign ok assign to view assign ok now go to commands design beam add and design column add close select design beam select total beams by using select beam to parallel and beam to parallel select assign ok now click on design column and select y axis in assign to select beams assign ok again command analysis perform analysis ok analysis run analysis save See, there is no error and no warning done now you can check the design by clicking the ok concrete design good concrete design as you can see here is using 8 bars 8 bars and bar size is 12 millimeter you can using create here you can see 20 num bars and 20 bar 8 nongs center to center 120 millimeter you can check the shear force bending moment deflection torsion bending moment bending on z moment data 